facts that may save your life one day, part 8. Make sure to close your bedroom door at night. The amount of damage done to a room with a closed door by a fire is way less than to one with an open door. This way you may have a chance to escape. In a kidnapping situation where the person is trying to force you to get in a vehicle and take you somewhere else, always fight to not get in that vehicle. If they're trying to take you somewhere private, they're planning to kill you or even worse. So it's better to get shot in a public place. If you encounter a mountain lion, do not turn your back on it, just walk backwards. Cats are ambush predators. They don't want to fight you head on and will wait for you to turn around to attack. Here are some tips that could actually save your life one day. Firstly, if a tornado ever appears to be standing still, well, it's an illusion and it's not what it looks like because it's probably coming right for you. So if a tornado ever appears to be standing still, you need to seek shelter fast. If you're ever in a pool and you taste a medley taste, get out immediately. This means there's an electric shortage somewhere and you will get shocked. If you ever have an emergency and you need to get somewhere fast but you have to go on an elevator, I got you. When you get into the elevator, hold your finger on the floor you want to go to and also the closed door button. Keep your fingers there the whole ride and the elevator won't stop for anything. Anyone. Next, if you're ever trapped in a sinking car, do not try to open up your door because the water pressure will be too strong. You need to unbuckle your seatbelt, roll down your window, and escape as fast as you can. Finally, if you ever get kidnapped, you want to try to scratch the kidnapper. This will allow their DNA to be in your fingernails. The police can track who it was. Facts that could save your life one day, part 9. Knocking at a desk or behind a wall and covering yourself when you see the light of a nuclear blast may save your life. Bears, if it's black, fight back. If it's brown, lay down. And if it's white, good night. If you or someone else ingests a chemical that they aren't supposed to, don't immediately try to throw it up. Instead, call poison control because some of them do more damage when coming back up. Here are some tips that could actually save your life one day. Firstly, if you are ever outside in a thunderstorm and your hair starts doing this, you need to run and seek shelter before it's too late because you are about to be struck by lightning. Next, if you're ever face to face with a deadly animal, you need to always keep eye contact with the animal and do not look away. Then you want to lift your arms up and make yourself look big as possible. This will make you look big and threatening and the animal will actually leave you alone. Next, if you're ever stuck in an elevator, do not try to open up the door and get out. This will upset the equal equilibrium and you will be crushed. So the best thing you can do is just stay calm and wait for help. Finally, if you ever think there's an intruder in your house, do not turn on the lights because you know your house better than them. It'll be easier for you to escape than them to find you. Facts that could save your life one day, part one. Polar bears have insane ADHD. If one is chasing you, immediately drop clothing items like a hat. The bear will be confused and it will stop to sniff them. If you need help in a public place, it's a bad idea to just scream help. Being specific is important, so point at someone and tell them to call 911. If you're buried alive, don't panic because you have a limited amount of oxygen. And before trying anything, pull your shirt over your head. You don't want to be swallowing dirt while you're trying to escape. Here is some life advice that you need to know. Okay, firstly, if you ever wake up in the middle of the night and you smell gas, do not turn on your lights. You need to go outside and call 911. Because if your house does have a gas leak, a spark from the light switch could blow it up. Next, this is one of the most painful things ever, a paper cut. Well, if you don't want any pain anymore and you want it to heal faster, just put chapstick on it. You know when you drop a piece of food on the ground and you say to yourself, five second roll and still eat it? Well, as soon as it hits the floor, tiny microscopic bugs will be on your food. So the next time you do the five second rule, you might be eating some bugs. You know these bubbles in your drink? Well, they could actually mean a lot more than you think. If you're ever outside with your drink and the bubbles are on the edge of the cup, it means there's high pressure and you're probably going to get good weather. But if the bubbles are more so in the middle, you need to find cover. Finally, remember that your phone can always call 911, even if you don't have a service provider or internet connection. Facts that could save your life one day, part 3. If your hair on your arm or your head is standing up during a thunderstorm, then lightning is about to strike you. If there is no building or car nearby, then crouch down immediately. This forces the lightning to find the next tallest thing in the area. If someone is trying to kidnap you and fighting back or yelling for help doesn't work, then pretend to faint or vomit on them. If you encounter a gorilla, stay low, don't look them in the eyes and be quiet. They take loud noises and movement as a challenge. And boom, you are dead. Here are some survival tips that could actually save your life one day. If you're ever out in the wild and hear this noise, 
If you ever hear that laugh, you need to get away as fast as possible. That's the noise a group of hyenas make when they get done with a fresh kill. They're communicating to hunt down a new prey, and that could be you. If you're ever out in the middle of nowhere and you don't have access to clean water, I got you. All you need to do is tear a part of your t-shirt off and use it to filter water. This actually works quite well and you're drinking a lot more healthier water. It is 2020, so you never know what could happen. If you're ever out somewhere and a nuclear explosion goes off, drop to the ground immediately and put your fingers in your ears while trying to breathe out of your teeth. In a nuclear explosion, the shockwave usually kills most people and not the fireball, so hopefully the shockwave will go over you. If you're ever out and can't tell the time, find a good horizon and do this. Every finger counts as 15 minutes. Multiply the number of fingers you have between the sun and horizon by 15. And now you can tell the time without wearing a watch. Facts that could save your life one day, part 13. If you're running away from a runway object, run to the side and not straight away. If you ever get buried by an avalanche, it may be hard to tell which way is up after getting tumbled around. But speeding will let gravity show you which way is down. And if somebody is drowning, it doesn't always look like they're drowning. It's not always like in the movies. So if somebody isn't panicking, don't think that they're not drowning. Here are some tips that could actually save your life one day. Firstly, if you're ever getting chased by a polar bear, just know they have insane ADHD. So all you have to do is drop something small, like a hat or glove, and the polar bear will stop and sniff it, and you will have time to get away. But if you're ever getting chased by another bear, do not climb a tree because they are great climbers. Instead, run down a hill because bears are not good at running down hills because they gain too much speed. Next, if you ever end up falling in the sky without a parachute, firstly, you do not want to land on water because water will feel like concrete. You need to put your body into an X shape this will slow down your fall. Your three best options for landing is a swamp, snow, or trees. Also, you want to land on your feet. This will absorb some of your impact and this will give you the best chance of living. Finally, if you ever notice a car is following you, do not go back to your house. Well, first, you need to make four right turns to see if they're actually following you. But if they are, you need to go to a police station immediately. Facts that could save your life one day, part 11. When a police officer wants to search your car, you can actually say no. Contrary to what the Jurassic Park made you believe, the T-Rex actually can see you if you stand still. If you fall through ice and you can't reach the surface but you can't climb out, place your arms out in the ice and don't move them. Your sleeves will freeze on the ice and they will hold you out of the water in case you pass out. If you ever get lost in the wilderness, just stop moving. Because you will just move further away from the place that the search for you will start. Instead build a shelter and start fire. And the fire will keep the animals away and will make it easier for you to be found. 